Hi, this is Mike Andrag for BreakingCall.com, and I now want to add a technical perspective to Brian Egger's recent fundamental comments on Royal Caribbean's earnings report, uh, that symbol RCL. We last looked at the charts following the October earnings announcement that sent the shares up about 6% following the report. The stock has subsequently continued its persistent uptrend as we predicted back in October based on the chart pattern and technical position. The most recent move, including the attempted rally continuation on the positive earnings results and established uptrend, are as expected. But now we have the stock up against the long-term resistance that may suggest increased volatility and the potential for a consolidation or a pullback near term as major overhead levels are tested. The long-term perspective is now important in RCL, so we're first going to look at a monthly chart. This time frame shows price up against not only an important early 2011 high at $49.99, but also a downtrend resistance line that runs down off of major trading highs in 1999 and 2005. Resistance at such major points that are separated by significant time spans and big reversal moves can be expected to take quite a bit of time if they are to be overcome. The chances of a reversal or serious correction also increase in situations like this. The most bullish technical case would be either a very quick breakout above resistance in the 50 to 51 area or a pause with sideways consolidation and limited downside. We would be more concerned on any sharp drop from resistance with volume increasing. Long-term support to watch is now first in the 42 to 44 area and then a more critical intermediate term level at 38. The weekly chart shows us a persistent uptrend that has accelerated up in recent weeks to challenge the previously discussed resistance highs. The angle of ascent increased and the stock has extended from moving average support. Weekly support levels approximate the longer term levels that we see on the monthly chart, uh, about $44. 40 bucks, and then the key level from both charts, $38, which equates to a 61.8% level. Closes below $38 would signal a possible major high or a trend change in play. If the stock can close above about 51, technical targets would move up by at least 5 to 10 points. Thanks for watching and visit us often at breakingcall.com.